we are going to come across with another topic called unbalanced assignment problem. So far we have seen the problems where you have number of rows is equal to number of columns. So we have solved the problem and we have got the solution. But there, there in the uh, board if you can see this problem which is given has 4 rows and 5 columns. That is 4 cross 5 matrix. If number of rows here, row, rows is not equal to column. Number of row is not equal to column mark. So at that period of time, the concept comes here is unbalanced assignment problem. So this is an unbalanced assignment problem. So first, you have to convert it into balanced assignment problem students. Okay, so how do you convert into balance assignment problem by adding a dummy row or a dummy column and you have to balance it. Now you can see there are 5 rows here, 5 columns here and 4 rows. So here you need to add one more row to make it a square matrix and what you will add the dummy values is nothing but 0 students. Okay, so the question given here is there are four jobs to be assigned to the machines. Only one job could be assigned to one machine. There should be only one job given to one machine. Okay, and the amount of time is in hours. Now here the question is given in hours. That means you have to get the answer in hours. Okay, required for the job in the machine are given below. Now first thing is you have to convert this unbalanced assignment problem into balanced assignment problem. That is J5 where we will add zeros. This is a dummy row. We are adding it and making it into 5 cross 5 matrix. Now this becomes 5 cross 5. 5 matrix. Now next we will go along with the step students. Okay. So step 1. Now can you say this matrix is a square matrix? Yes. yes. So the given matrix is a square matrix. Where number of rows is equal to number of column. Okay, then step 2 calculate row redundancy RR. Same thing it starts like other problems M1, M2, M3, M4, M5, J1, J2, J3, J4, J5. Okay. Now in this row what is the minimum value? 2 is the minimum value. Okay. So here it is 2, 1, one 4, zero, 0 and 5. five. Then next minimum value is 10. ten. So 0, two, 2, 1, 4, four and 6. Next minimum value is 1. So here it is 3, three 2, two one, 1, 0, 4. The next minimum value here is 6. Okay. So here it is 2, two 1, one three, 3. Sorry. Sorry. 0, 3 and 0. Then same. Zeros. Okay, now let's start with next step that is step 3 calculate column redundancy. <coughs> Okay, now same, here same same values you will get yes M1, M2, M3, M4, M5. 
here it is j of 1, job 2, job 3, job 4, job 5. So because every column you have zeros, the same table will repeat. So it is 2, 0, 3, 2, 0. 1, 1, 2, 2, 1, 1, 0, 0, 4, 1, 1, 1, 0, 0, 0, 4, 0, 3, 0, 5, 6, 4, 0, 0. Okay. Now, can we do the step 4 here only? Yes, ma'am. Okay. So, here, step 4, assign symbol symbol using Hungarian method okay now here here only one zero is there in this row I put the assignment to this second is here I put the assignment to it and cancel this zero and here also this will get cancelled. Okay, then third row we don't have zeros. Fourth row, yes there is one zero. I am striking the rest. Fifth, I am putting it here. So again it is un that is assignments are not balanced. There are only four assignments. Now you have to make it five. Okay. So where you have to check in where there is no assignment that is J3 you don't have assignment and where you have 0 in this column M4 and the assignment is in J1 so J2 I am cancelling J4 J5 and M4 minimum value again 1 yes so 1 is the minimum value then again I am writing the step M1 M2 M3 M4 M5 J1 J2 J3 J4 J5 now here there is no strike mark so you have to subtract 1 0 0 5. There is a single strike, same value. Okay. So One, again four. 0. You have J2, right? Four. Here strike, yeah, correct. 4. Four. Yeah, correct. 4. Yes. So here it is 0, 2, two, two one, 1, 4, four six. 6. No, here Haan. intersection Haan. is there. Five, no, five, five, five. So it is five. 5 and six. 6. The next it is 2, two one, 1, 0, zero. 0, 3. three. Ah. So again 2, two 1, one zero. 0 intersection 4, four 0. zero. Then next it is 0, 0, zero, zero, zero one. intersection 1, zero. 0. Okay, now we'll do the assignment for this. Here, anyway, I can take the assignment. Now. This first one I am taking ma, striking this and this zero. Then second, second. I have to take it here only. Mm. There is no other zeros. I am striking the zero. Third, I will take here. Strike the zero. Fourth, either I can take my here or here. It's up to us. Okay. This get cancer this will get cancer plus yeah. so are there five assignments yes, now yes, yes so we got five assignments and we have to write those five assignments here so the next is optimum solution we need to find out and total in hours okay so here therefore the optimum Solution mine only optimum solution is J one to M two J two to M one 
J3 to M4, M4. J4 to M3. M3 J5 to M5. M5 Now we need to write those values here Now in this question J1 to M2 is 3 J2 to M1 is 10 J3 to M4 is 1 J4 to M3 is 6 J5 to M5 is 0 So it is 16, 17, 18, 19, 20 Therefore the total hours to Complete the job is 20 hours. Okay, students. So, with this, we have learned an unbalanced transportation, uh, sorry, assignment problem. Thank you all. Have a great day.